This review is of Southgate Estofado de Res, or Beef Stew. <laughs> I hope I said it correctly. Uh, probably not, but, you know, I'm not exactly a Spanish speaker. And, uh, ah! there are the nutrition facts and the ingredients. So it does contain soy. What a surprise! It's so hard to find products that don't contain soy these days because they use it for all kinds of stuff, for fake meat, for uh, soy flour, for soy lecithin, and so on and so forth. And, um, all right, so it doesn't look that appealing right now because of the fat globs that you can see in there, or maybe it's grease, I don't know. But, um, Let's see what happens when we heat it up. So an interesting side effect of heating it up is the flavor is darker than what we saw when it was in the can. We've got potatoes and carrots and of course we've got the meat. Like that piece of meat just doesn't want to show itself. Yeah. So let's get a little bit of everything. There. Doesn't that look good? Well, I hope so, because I had Southgate, a Southgate product once before, and I was not impressed. I grew up on canned uh, beef stew. Um, I thought it was the bomb. This one has kind of a weird uh, flavor. I don't know if it's what it is. Hold on a second here. Try stirring it up. <sighs> All right, it's stirred up, so I'm gonna try just the carrot right now. And hopefully there doesn't seem like there's a lot of carrot in here, so seems like there are more potatoes. The carrot is just this far away from being a puree. It's really, really super soft. Doesn't really have much flavor. So let me try the potato. Also, not really flavorful. No. Call me crazy, but when I eat a stew, I expect to be able to taste the vegetables that are in it. And I can't taste the vegetables that are in this. So let's get a let's get one of those rare pieces of meat. Excuse me. Sorry for burping. Did you know that in parts of Indonesia, Hungary, and other countries, burping is not only accepted, it is a compliment to the chef. So whatever machine made that or person. I'm uh, not complimenting it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had really kind of hoped that it would taste better. I mean, it's not as bad as I remember it to be, but it's also not wonderful. Um... Certainly, if you want to have a good beef stew the from, from a can, right? Not homemade, right? Um, you're better off with Dinty Moore or one of the other main brands. Southgate, I'm sorry, it's just... It has a lackluster flavor with a weird aftertaste. I just... And you can't taste the vegetables. And it's it just seemed to be only two things. Potatoes and carrots. I mean, where are the onions? And other things that you might want to have in your your stew. I, I, I just, I really am disappointed. That's the way it is. Thank you very much and have a good day.